I plea and I, I, I request the elders, when you have your youngsters coming in, today the conditions are very loose. We're not living in the times where you know, kids come in, they're very quiet, they sit, mashallah, they're brilliant namazi, they're holding the tasbih. They're going to come and they're going to make a few blunders here and there. Be gentle with them. We've had many of a situation where, unfortunately, the elder, and alhamdulillah, they mean good by it. So I don't mean no disrespect, they'll give them a little clap or a slap. They're not used to that at school. So their teacher at school is showing them all the muhabbat, and mashallah, chacha or haji sahab in the masjid is being rough. What are they going to associate the masjid to be? Just a pain in the neck. We used to go and we used to get beats. Molly sahab was beating, uncle was beating, haji sahab was beating, buzuruk was beating, everyone was just beating. And then we say, by come to the masjid, they say, what for? So you can beat me again. So show that muhabbat. Did the Prophet ﷺ ever strike anybody? No. He never struck, he never hit anybody in that way. He never was forceful, he showed muhabbat and showed love. When you move from the sunnah, there will be nuqsan, and this is the nuqsan which is created. When we see anyone coming to the masjid, even if we see a youngster coming in tight top, cut arms, or what are we going to say to him? Yaar Tawbah Astaghfar, is this a nightclub or is it a masjid? Is he ever going to come back again? No, he's not. You've lost the youngster. You've lost him. You've lost him. Or he'll just go back and say, you know, I ain't got time to hear this man. What? I ain't got time to hear this garbage. And walk out. And he'll owe us all they'll think of the deen. And I'm telling you, that feeling of hatred, it lasts for an awful long time. And then you have to do twice as much effort just to get that person back on the simple level again. And where we don't even have that. So can you imagine how many broken hearts there are out there? That we have done this to. And in their heart they've got this feeling that you know that person. And they don't realize themselves that they can get someone back on the day of judgment. But Allah knows he can. So Allah will call him and say, do you remember that person hit you? Jalla, take your badala now. And he can't take badala, so Jalla, give him your good deeds. And you put your bad deeds on him. Don't miss, don't take this as something minor. We all need to fix up.